it's Hikes here, and today we are making another Dragon Adventures video. Today, I have made a very bad decision. So, because I thought it'd be interesting, and there's like nothing new at the moment, at least I don't think so. But, <laughs> if you saw the title, which I don't know if the title's gonna be titled exactly what I'm doing, but what I'm going to be doing is selling mostly everything in my inventory, unless it's like, I know these things I can't sell, but like if there's something like special that I feel like I probably won't be able to get back, I might keep like a few of them because who knows why. Like I don't need to keep the heart cookies, I could sell those if I needed to because I got this plant right here. I could just get more anytime I feel like it. And I got a thousand apples. I know that wouldn't get me that much money, but... So, like, the only thing I'm gonna keep out of my food section is probably, like, ten candy canes. And the rest of my heart treats. And the pears. Everything else can leave. Actually, if the pumpkin doesn't sell for that much, I might keep, like, ten pumpkins. Because, honestly, pumpkins are actually pretty good to have. But I already have, like... Do I have two pumpkin plants? I got one. I was pretty sure I had two. Oh, okay. I might have another one just somewhere around here. <laughs> I don't know where exactly, but I was pretty sure I had another pumpkin plant. Oh, okay. Well, um, apparently, maybe not, but you know, it's fine. You can still always get more pumpkins, but like, I only want to try and sell them if they'll like get me a lot, because if not, there's really no point in selling them, you know? Anyways, that's what the video is gonna be and then I can bring one set of dragons unless I like Delete them and then delete the one I got and then you know, I'll have another space But once again, I kind of changed the colors on Queen I had a potion that was like um, a Valentine one So I used it because I thought it'd be really pretty and it was really pretty like look at this Ooh, Cute <laughs> You're all probably like, but the other colors were much better. Nah, he, they were for getting like random colors, but like I would prefer this because this is kind of like cute colors though. I don't know why, but when I'm near like my base, like the dragon bounces. But anyways, the whole reason as to why I was sell gonna sell all my stuff was to see one, how much money I could get, two, for a video idea because I wanted to make a video on Dragon Adventures, and I was like, wait a second, there's not really anything new at the moment. So, it's like, well, let's try and come up with an idea that sounds very stupid, could make people mad, and <laughs> make myself upset because realizing I might need those things. But you know what? I'll make myself suffer. You guys understand? It's my fault. Here. Uh, yes. See? And then if I put something in like my storage, then I can just salvage it and I can get more stuff to sell. Because uh, I think if I was to take everything in here and get rid of it, I think I get a pretty good amount of stuff. I mean, because it did take a lot of stuff to like create this. But also, you don't get back like what you use. Like for the bush, it 10 and you only get like two back as just shown there okay so i have kind of second thoughts on this but we'll just go with it i can i'm okay with selling the apples because you know the apples i get like literally every 30 seconds so they don't really make me upset to lose them the heart cookies you know i have a plant for those I do not get them that quickly, but I still get them. So that's why I'll sell 53, so I'll still have 10. Because, once again, I don't really use them, but this plant is every 45 minutes of getting them. So I might just want to keep a few. And see, I already got more apples to sell. Also, carrots. Let's sell you guys, because I never use the carrots. If I'm being honest, I never use them. Like... I always get them. I never feed them to my dragons. I always use pears. So that's why I never usually get rid of the pears. Hold on a second. Ooh, oh my gosh. That is a big price. Okay. Oh my geez. Whoa, could you imagine? 
Oh, you'd be rich. <laughs> okay, there we go. I'm just gonna keep 10 of like from the things that I feel like I just want to keep a few of because you know Gotta just have a few and you see always getting them apples up All right, what was I gonna sell next? Um, the candy cane. Yes, okay. I, I I'm sorry. I had to do some like bad math there See these cost a lot and I think it's because well, look, you can buy them. Why do they cost so much? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, well, we'll keep 10 of those for no reason at all. What else do I have? Ooh, what did I just collect? Ooh, carrots again. Okay, I can also sell these fish and the golden apples for sure. All right, and we'll keep the heart treats though. Alrighty then. So fish, where are you at? We got a hundred of you. You don't really matter that much. I'm sorry you had to hear it like that, <laughs> but you don't. Golden apples don't cost that much either, apparently. Okay, then. And then we can sell our apples again. <laughs> and the carrots, too. Get out of here. All right. Let's move on to resources now because... Actually, no. Let's sell the meat as well because I don't use that no more. I'm only a pear kind of person. And dragon fruit. Dragon fruit... Fruit is really good to just have in your inventory to just feed your dragons constantly. Gotta sell that pumpkin right there. Gotta sell these bad apples. Alright, let's see. Now we'll move on to healing. Alright. Mm, we can get rid of the crystal treats because I don't use those like ever. And y'all are probably gonna be like, I could have used those. Well, I'm selling them. Hold on, can I sell them? Oh geez, where do I sell them? Oh, right here, healing. My bad. It's because they're in different spots. See, healing is like right under food and then healing's under resources now. All right, I can sell 98. There you go. Gotta always just keep 10. We'll sell 77 of you. Ooh, geez, look at that money, 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 money. <laughs> Revive crystals, Uh, 73. You see, I don't get that much from you guys. You guys are weak the selling now we can go to resources so i have like a bunch of petals i can just sell because i never like do sell them because i've been buying like all these like big blossom trees but i don't need any more at the moment so we can say goodbye to them i will probably have only like 10 of the aurora borealis and 10 of the fairy jars because you know I don't know what they do, but I would like to keep a few of them in case there's something special about them, you know? Alright, so I feel like I could- Yeah, you sell these for a lot of money, though. Alright, but we still get a lot just for seven of them. And for you, you get 30. I have to do this math, and I'm not liking it. <laughs> um, do I have evil bats? I thought I did. Oh, can I not click them? Okay, then. Let's use 38. Get rid of those. Okay, ice crystals. You're just seeing me struggle at math here. You can get a lot of money for these. Okay, 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 okay. Icicles. These don't sell for that much. What do they do? Okay. Gotta use this math again. 123. See, you don't get that much from that. Okay. Well, that's odd. Where are the flower petals? Here. So, you still won't get a lot, but, you know, because for the amount that you have of getting, like, selling, and then it's not that much money you get for them. That's the sad thing. All right. Do I have sand or sandstone? No, I don't. I have stone. Let's keep 100 because, you know, I usually end up needing stone for something. And so, I just gotta have some. Wood, there's no point in really farming it and then selling it. Because you always just... You don't get that much. It's it's bad. You don't get that much. And actually, do you get that much? No, you don't. No, okay. And it doesn't even sell for that much. So, there's really no point in really getting wood for anything. I mean, I get it a lot for just decor and stuff. You know, just stupid things. Ghost essence, snowflake. Okay, I want to see how much I can sell the snowflake for. That's a good question. Snowflake, there you are. Okay, you don't sell for that much either. Okay, okay, okay. And leaves, get over here. I'll just sell all of you because what's the point in keeping? It costs so much. All right, I think that's it for here. 
Yes, hold on, let me check. Resources? Oh, I do have some sandstone. Well, there's no point in really selling it because it's only a bit. All right, so that has gotten me around, I started with like 19,000. 40,000 maybe yes okay i don't know exactly this would be around like a high high forty thousands, and or it could be low fifty thousands. i don't know i'm not exactly that good at math at the moment because i'm just doing some brain math so it's not going to be exact <laughs> but i did get a lot of money from what i had and i did have very little resources so you know yeah but like i said before in a video i don't usually use the coins i don't usually buy things i don't usually like i don't do a lot of things rewards oh in an hour <gasps> no <laughs> okay oh my gosh hold on i gotta go back to spawn my bad so i would completely just skipped over the fact that i was gonna breed the dragons and also there was something else i was gonna do at the base what was it that's the question i don't know okay well that's nice <laughs> i don't you know what the thing i was gonna do was oh, dude what <laughs> i don't know i oh yes okay i was gonna check this so we could buy like one of these potions that's that was oh my gosh okay and we could choose we could have buy like one of these three or we could just buy the personality potion, but it's really no point there. But if we do buy it, actually, I might not get a potion because what is the wire doing? Because the last video I did, I think it was the last video, I did it on potions. So we might not also because I am still trying to work up to upgrade this and also because I think they're supposed to have a new map coming out soon so to be prepared and have like money aside for that is a good thing as well so we'll probably just keep this and try and breed the dragons i haven't gotten like a mutation dragon yet like making a video i don't think like while breeding them i haven't gotten one with the mutation yet so let's see here i also did get rid of um the one female pumpkin i had and did i get rid of the one male skeleton no i don't no i didn't he's here right here okay he's here uh but i did get rid of the female pumpkin which was a bad mistake i well not really because her colors weren't that good because i didn't like you guys didn't get to see her with her colors though before like i got rid of her but they weren't really that good all right so let's see i'm gonna try venom and sugar pea because they both have green and i mean sugar pea is a sweetheart and venom i can't say the same but like their colors could be good like couldn't as well um there's a high chance of it getting a mutation and having the worst colors ever it's, there's just these chances that it's not good all right you look like you have good colors what like okay you have a mutation and it's a pumpkin but it has grass okay but that's fine it can keep the grass Woo, okay, that's that. Let's go. I think that's the first. Okay, guys, that's the, that's going to be it for this video. <laughs> yes, but um we finally got a dragon with a mutation while breeding the pumpkins and the skeletons. Yay! I mean, Pocky was I think the first one I got like on camera with a mutation like while breeding. The other guys I was given, and so they were just, they had, like, mutations when I was given them. But Pocky, I think, was the first, um, pumpkin dragon. I'm sorry, I'm forgetting the breed name. The first pumpkin dragon I had with a mutation that I got on camera. And I still have yet to get a skeleton with a mutation, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they all don't have mutations, and I have, like read the skeletons a lot and it's just surprising i still haven't gotten like a skeleton with mutations but i have gotten a bunch of pumpkins with mutations there was one mutation on the pumpkin that i saw on someone else's wasn't mine 
It was the cutest mutation I've ever seen. Even if it had ugly colors, I, I can't remember, but if I had one that had that mutation and the colors were still really bad, I would keep it. But it was the mutation of the pumpkin that made it like, it looked like it had a mane around its head made with the leaves. Like, you see how, like, we'll use Pocky as a demonstration, how there's like these small leaves, they went all around the head and it was just absolutely adorable and I was like, oh my god. <laughs> so, that could be a possibility of the mutation with this one here, this little youngin over here. But once again, it's another male, but that's fine with me as long as we got the mutations. But anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, part of the squad. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!